guys, so um, in case you haven't heard, I've left McDonald's recently, about a week ago, and um, you know, I've, I've gone on the hunt for jobs, and uh, you know, a lot of people would say, oh, it's extremely hard to find a job, you know, oh, don't even bother, well, you know, I mean, uh, you know, it's not about, it's, it is a bad time to look for a job, but it's not impossible to get a job, I understand, you look around, all the clothes shops are closed, <laughs> Man, if those clothes shops were still open, it would be much easier to find a job, okay? So, you know, it's a good thing. I'm living in uh, the capital of Ireland. We've got so many places. Um, so, yes, um, so yesterday I tried, uh, I handed out 20 different CVs to different places, mainly around O'Connell Street, Parnell Street, uh, even, I think I went to Westmoreland Street as well. Today I went into, you know, Grafton Street, uh, Stevens Green, um, you know, and different streets, uh anyway so um i handed out 20 yesterday and today i had 24 i was meant to hand out 25 but i was just you know i kept i kept going into places and asking if they take my cv they kept saying no so i was like oh fuck it, let's go home i handed out loads today so you know anyway so 44 cvs to hand out in general in total um t uh last two days and uh yeah i have actually gotten a job well i've gotten a trial for tomorrow spar in what's it Dolier Street or something like that. It's just off O'Connell Bridge. Um, so yeah, I'm I'm doing a ten to two shift, quite a short shift. Um, you know, cause uh, you know, it's just a trial. Do you know what I mean? So they told me to dress all in black, be there for ten to two, and yeah, I'm just looking for part time work. Uh, cause you know, I don't, I think full time work is too much. Um, you know, especially cause I'm I'm a minimist. I'm quite frugal. I can probably survive off a part time job. Uh, salary. Now, if I ever want to progress my career, if I ever want to get promoted to management or something like that, of course, I'm going to have to increase my hours to full-time work, uh, maybe even more than that. But, you know, for now, I'm not really, it's not really a goal of mine. So, um, yeah, uh, that, that's it, you know, so I, so I, I managed to uh, find a job, so uh, so can you, so can you. So, um, yeah, looking forward to this, uh, part-time, hopefully they'll give me part-time. That's one thing I'm worried about, if they only offer me, like, a full-time contract, hopefully they'll offer me like a 20 hour a week contract um so yeah because you know i'm planning to move out i'm back living with my mother now for for now but i like to move somewhere maybe around city center or the north side because you know i'm on the south side in carrick mines uh the rent is quite expensive down here so i'd like to move somewhere cheaper uh city center is quite cheap north side is quite cheap there's not a lot of places uh uh on the uh website up for uh rent but you know i'm looking forward to Finding some place, you know, maybe for 250, 300 euro a month, um, so I can just make enough money, pay my own way, just working part-time hours. So I get more time to just chill, relax, spend more time outside, get my vitamin D, my sunlight, because they say vitamin D is actually a feel-good hormone. So, and, you know, we're really depriving ourselves of it, but living this indoorsy lifestyle, you know. Um, it's one of the reasons we're one of the most depressed generations in history. Our lifestyle just isn't healthy. It's completely robotic. Um, so yeah, I'm going to call out the names of all the places I applied to in the last two days, but I'll do, I'll, I'll say that for the end of the video, because I understand some of you watching, uh, will probably fall asleep. <laughs> you know, that, that's what I do. So actually I wrote, I write down the names of the places that I've applied to. Um, the reason is so I don't go to the same place too often, you know, um, cause they say it's good to follow up, but not any more than like once a week. So, you know, um, like if you hand in a like I I was going to go to Euro Giant today, hand in a CV, but I checked my notes from yesterday and found I already sent in a CV uh yesterday, so I was like, nah, I can't be doing that. So you can't be um handing in a CV every single day. That's you know they say that that's like a sign that you're desperate, and employers don't actually like that. So yeah, not easy. It's not easy to find a job in this climate, but it's not impossible. Um, so I suggest you know uh searching especially if you live in a big city if you live in a small town that's very awkward <laughs> you know won't be many places uh hiring so uh yeah anyway so now i'm gonna read the the list out to you um so this was the 14th of um january that was yesterday so places i tried kfc parnell street burger king parnell street deals across the road from Jervis street uh marks and spencers across the road from the ilac center that's north side somewhere I tried Easton's on O'Connell Street. I tried Londis on O'Connell Street. I tried Boojum in Abbey Street. I tried Euro Giant on Abbey Street. I tried Londis on Westmoreland Street. I tried Supermax on Westmoreland Street. I, tr I tried Centra in Temple Bar. I tried Apache uh, on the Keys near O'Connell Street. I don't know the name of that uh, street. 
Deals, Lower Abbey Street, um, Chopped, Parnell Street, Parnell Mall, actually, Eddie Rockets, Parnell Street, XL, Parnell Street, Eurojoint, Moore Street, Deals, Ilex Center, Starbucks, North Earl Street, and Eurojoint, North Earl Street. So that was the, those are the places I tried yesterday, the 14th of January. So today, 15th of January, the places I've tried, Gino's Gelato, uh, Grafton Street, that's an ice cream shop, uh, Burger King, Grafton Street, uh, Starbucks, uh, what's that, Chatham Street, um, Gino's uh, Gelato, uh, Grafton Street as well, there's two on Grafton Street, The Rolling Donut, King Street South, um, Eason's, uh, Stevens Green Shopping Centre, Chopped between Trinity and Grafton uh, Street, okay, Spar, College Green, Londis, College Green, Spar, Dame Street, Apache Pizza, Dame Street, Abracababra, Dame Street, Subway, Parliament Street, uh, Spar, Parliament Street, um, D Fontaine's New York Pizzeria, Parliament Street, Pick and Pay, Parnell Street, uh, Centra, Marlborough Street, uh, Gala, Lower Abbey Street, uh, Donut, uh, George's Key, uh, Spar, Dolier Street, that's where I'm getting my um, trial tomorrow, uh, it was the fifth last place I tried, Spar, uh, Ashton Key, Smoke and Bones, Essex Street East, Centra, Parnell Street, Gino's, Gelato, uh, Henry Street. They're, they're all the 44 places I've tried, okay? So, um, kind of similar to uh, last time when I got hired from McDonald's. I, I can't remember exactly. I think it was about 35, 40 places I applied to. So, I went to the library on the Monday. I printed out 25 CVs, handed them all to places. I uh, had them all out and then I went to the library again the next day to try to another 25 CVs, try to hand them all out. I handed out about half of them, so probably about 10 to 15 of them. And uh, that's when I got my job at McDonald's. So yeah, similar story, you know, 44 CVs and I finally got my um uh, trial and trial tomorrow, 10 to 2. Hopefully that works out. Um, you know, I'm going to just go in there and just do my best and hope for the best, you know.